Why ants work together? Together, Pamboja. Together, Pamboja. Together, <laughs> but there was a time when ants didn't work together. There were so many of them and they were so tiny that it was a big problem. What are they doing? I don't know. They're falling over and bumping into each other. <laughs> Look! Mm. We're trying to build a home. I think they're playing. We're not playing. We're building a home. Huh? We can't hear you. We are working. What are they saying? I don't know. Hmm? Uh, permission to speak, Chief. Yes, Lieutenant. I don't think the monkeys can hear you. I got that. Thank you, Lieutenant. Maybe the other animals will know what they're doing. Come on, let's find out. Unbelievable. Uh, Chief, while I've got you, all the ants are very tired, and we don't seem to be getting very far with the building. Do you think maybe we need some help? Hard work. That's all it takes, Lieutenant. Hard work. But, Chief... Lieutenant, in this world, it is every ant for himself. But, Chief... Now, ants, gather around. We have a home to build. What do we have? A home to build. And what builds homes? Hard work. Now, it's a tough world in Tinga Tinga. So it's every ant for himself to work. Look, look. Ooh, look here. Ants. Look at that. What are they doing? They're trying to build a home, monkey. Why? Every beast needs a home. Birds have nests, lions have caves, monkeys... Have trees! And tortoise has a shell. <laughs> <laughs> Quite so. But the poor little ants have nowhere to call their own. Lion, can't we help the ants? No, leave them be. It's nature's way. But they're not even strong enough to lift up a leaf. It's making me tired just looking at them. Whew. I need to sit down. No, and run! And run! Oh, oh, oh. oh Hippo, no! Oh. The ants oh. are running away. Can't we help them? Yes, can't we help? Oh, oh, oh. oh I think I'm going to sneeze. Elephants, no. I think Elephants. it's going to be a big one. Uh. Scatter! Run! Uh. Scatter! Uh. Quick, monkeys, hold elephant's trunk. Uh. Take your mind off it. Try and think of something. Uh. Anything? Oh, yes. I got it. Uh. Excuse me. What were you thinking about, elephant? Sneezing. You were supposed to think about anything but sneezing. Sorry, big head see, tiny brain. <laughs> <sighs> right, right. Everyone here? Yes. Good, good. Now, this seems like the perfect place for our home. Hapa, hapa, right here. But, Chief. I think we need help. No, no, no. No help. Ostrich, I'm going to huh? get you. <laughs> you never get me. <laughs> and scatter. Oh, yes, I will, Ostrich. And scatter. Scatter. I'm going to nip you. <laughs> you never get me. <laughs> oh, yes, I will. <laughs> hmm? Chief, let's go underground. Oh, yes. Quickly. Hmm. Perfect. Underground, ants! Underground! Oh. 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 Mm. Now, this is the perfect place for our home. Hapa Hapa, right here. Underground. Jambo ants! Ah, ostrich! And scatter! Hiding from hyena. And scatter! Ants? Ants? Anything I can do to help? Where did Ostrich go? Hmm. Ostrich! Ostrich! Ah, ah. <laughs> but, Chief, don't you think that with a little help we could build a man? No, no, no! No help! Oh, yes! Oh, there's a branch! Perfect! But, sir, maybe the animals could lend us a hand. No, no, and no, no, help! Got it. Oh, help! Don't worry, Chief. I'm here. I've got you. Oh. Help! Oh. Whoa. Oh. 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 What is 
is happening? I think Eagle wants the twig for her nest. All the way up there. I'm afraid so, sir. There. Better get some more. Hey, hey, Eagle. Eagle, you can't leave us up here. Oh, what's the point? No beast can see us or hear us. All they do is squash us or leave us up in trees. <laughs> ants! Ants! Woohoo! Woohoo! Up here! We're up here! Oh, leave it, Lieutenant. We might as well give up. Give up? No, no, no! We have to have hope! <gasps> Wait! Chief! Chief! I think I found it! The perfect place for a home! Over there! Perfect place? Huh. There's no such thing. There is! Look! An island in the middle of the waterhole! We'll be protected and safe and able to see all the animals for miles. But we are stuck up a very tall tree. <gasps> it's hopeless. No, it's not. But we have to work Pamoja. Hmm? Pamoja? Yes, Pamoja. Together. I have heard enough. No. If we help each other, we can get down this tree. And if we can do that, then we can all build a home. Pamoja, together. And that's what we need to do. Come on, I'll hold your arms and you climb down. Then you hold my legs and I'll climb down. If we help each other, then we can make it. Pamoja, together. You are quite a remarkable aunt. Pamoja. Together. If we both work together, together you will see. <laughs> you and me together at the bottom of the street. If we both work together, together me and you, together is Pamoja. There's nothing we can't do. Hey. Yo! <laughs> ants, ants, quiet, come here. Meet Lieutenant, a clever little ant. An ant who has shown me that together we can do anything. Together we can lift a leaf. Together we can lift a leaf. Together, oh. we can drag a twig. Together, we can drag a twig. Oh, oh, oh. Together, we can build a home. Together. Together. Pamoja. Pamoja. Together. Pamoja. Together. 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 Pamoja. Pamoja. Together. Pamoja. Together. Woo! Ready for work? Yes, Chief. Together, Pamoja. <laughs> well done, Lieutenant. Together, Pamoja. Together, you'll <laughs> see. <laughs> Look, singing twigs. They are not singing twigs, elephant. They are singing ants. Wow. Jumbo elephant. Sorry about the sneeze. <laughs> no worries, elephant. No worries. <laughs> Working together. Now that's more like it. <laughs> it is nature's way. Come on, let's follow them. <laughs> <laughs> All of us together, a little ant army. One tree, one bridge. Oh, one wow! Tree, one bridge. Look at those ants! Uh, remarkable. If we all That's together, good. Come on. Together, That's it. One. Come on. This way, ants. This way. Hill monkeys, the ants have built their very own ant hill. Their very own home. Hey, hey, our very own ant hill. And we have the shade of our very own tree. Pamoja! Together! And that is why ants work together. From that day on, they learned that together they can do anything. Pamoja! Together! Pamoja! Together! <laughs> uh, funny looking tree though. Huh? Uh? Jambo, everyone. Astrid! <laughs> you haven't seen Hyena, have you? Oh. And Astrid? Well, that's a whole other story. <laughs> <laughs> wow! 
why spider has a tiny waist. You see, there was a time when spider didn't have a tiny waist. <laughs> Flies, my favorite. <laughs> She loved to eat. <laughs> oh, fresh grubs! You can't beat these. <laughs> well, unless you find some honey and then. <laughs> Two things Spider loved food and more food. <laughs> and she was always on the lookout for more. <laughs> <laughs> News? Uh, what news? Food news or boring news? But we're not telling you, Spider. Mm. Yes, he does. Is that so? Well, that's the buzz from the bees. They said... <laughs> the bees definitely said... Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. When you get to the point, Spider, what? Oh. Such a busy body, Spider. Hmm. Now, Elephant, huh? where is the feast going to be? I know I should remember, Lion, but I can't. <laughs> Big head, see? Tiny brain, we know. <laughs> easy, Elephant, easy. <sighs> Let's try again. Try and remember the feast. Where is it? OK, OK. <laughs> uh... I know I should remember lion, but I can't. Big head, see? Tiny, tiny, tiny little brain. No matter. Let's try again. Oh, I can't hang around all day. Spider, eavesdropping on our conversation again, are we? You call that a conversation? Oh, I'll have to find out from another animal. <laughs> Do you know what all the fuss is about? Some animal is cooking up a feast. I know it. Hey, hey, hey! Where are my flies? Those were my flies. Spider? You see, something is definitely happening. Bees don't buzz about nothing. Uh? <laughs> oh, but while the bees are out of their nest, I could just pop in and get some honey. <laughs> well, I'm not telling that greedy spider where the fist is. Mm, delicious! <laughs> you can't beat honey unless you got honey and mangoes, and then you're talking. <laughs> Spider will hear. North and south, west and east, four. Oh, I'll have to get closer and listen in. The bee said four feasts, four, but not a word about any of them. Four feasts! <laughs> oh. Uh, is that is that my brain? It's not your brain, elephant. It's spider. Mm -hmm. Spider is inside my head. No, elephant. Spider is on top of your head. <laughs> so, where are these feasts? Oh, spider, you're all sticky. That'll be the honey. <laughs> spider took all my flies, then helped herself to the bees' honey. Mm -hmm. On monkeys, where are these parties? I'll give you a mango. No, no, no. Three mangoes. Hmm. No. no. Oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. So, tortoise, I hear there are four parties with lots of food. You don't happen to know where they are, do you? No. Uh, uh, please. Mm hmm. Right. 
If no one will tell me where to go, they'll just have to show me. Right, here I go. Let's spin. Spin, spin, spin. Spinny, spinny, spinny. Spin a little more, spin a little here, spin a little there. That's it. Hippo! Off to the party. I am. But I'm not going to tell you anything. Oh, that's fine. I just wanted to wish you a very good time. Oh, oh, and Hippo, your ears a little bit wonky. <gasps> Allow <Ooh>. me. <laughs> that's better. Thank you, Spider. Asante. See you later. <laughs> One party down, three to go. <laughs> <laughs> mangoes, lovely mangoes. Hmm. What are you up to, Spider? Nothing. Come and get them. <laughs> <laughs> two parties down, two to go. <laughs> Frog, sorry for eating all your flies earlier. <laughs> No worries. Thank you. Flies. <laughs> Enjoy the party. A Santa spider. And now for the last one. <laughs> I'll just spin a little web. <laughs> Do the party. Do the party. Four threads leading to four parties and four lots of food. <laughs> now, which party shall I go to first? Oh, oh here we go. <laughs> that must be Frog. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's definitely Hippo. <laughs> or maybe I should go to the monkey's mango party. <laughs> <laughs> All that honey! Oh, it's almost too much for a spider to hope for. Hippo? Frog? The bees? Or the monkey mango party? Which one? Which one? I want to go to them all! It's run out! My thread's run out! I'm sorry, but I tricked you. I spun threads around you so I could follow you to the parties, but then I got tangled up. I thought it was a difficult journey. Oh, poor spider. Have you had anything to eat? <laughs> not a single fly, <gasps> but I'm not very hungry. Not hungry? What's wrong with you, spider? I don't think I can fit much food in. I know. Look at your tiny waist. It is tiny, isn't it? From all the pulling. From now on, I promise I won't chase everyone else's food. I'm going to spin myself a web and sit on it. Let the food Ooh. come to me. Catching flies in your own web. That is brilliant. So that's why Spider has a tiny waist. <laughs> Bees and their precious honey? Well, that's a whole other 
a story. <laughs> Why eagle rules the skies? <laughs> But you see, there was a time when no beast ruled the skies, and it was becoming a bit of a problem. My eggs! Huh? My eggs! Oh, what is it? Hmm. It's quiet. My eggs! Well, just calm down. No, what do they look like? My eggs! <gasps> Hen's nest! And it's empty! My eggs! You can see all that way? That's amazing! <laughs> well, they don't call me eagle eyes for nothing. Come on! Wait for me! My eggs! My eggs! My eggs! Calm down, everyone. Now, Hen, where did you last see your eggs? In my nest, where I laid them. Uh-uh. They're not there. What am I going to do? Don't worry, Hen. We'll find your eggs in the morning, as soon as it's light. I'll find your eggs. Oh, I do hope so, Eagle. Thank you. Now, everyone, to sleep. Birds, lullaby, please. A one and a two and a three and a four. <laughs> I like it. Bird, try again. What is happening up there? Why is Hummingbird not humming? That lion has lost my hum. <clears throat> hummingbird has lost her hum. Lost her hum? Well, that's what Hummingbird does. It's nature's way. Oh dear. Oh dearie me. Don't worry, Hummingbird. I'll find your hum and hen's eggs. Now, where can they be? Oh, Your Majesty! Really? Your Majesty! Something else has gone missing! What is it? Tickbird! Tickbird? I was with her in the morning, and then I went for a little swim, and when I surfaced, she was gone! Oh, no! Have you looked for her? All day long, but I can't find her! <gasps> She's so tiny, she could be anywhere! Now, calm down, everyone! Hippo, we will find Tickbird, don't you worry. Oh, sorry about that. What is it with these birds? It's impossible to watch over them all. It's the wings thing, Your Majesty. Very hard to watch over them when they keep flying all over the place. First hen loses her eggs, then hummingbird loses her hum, and now Tickbird. What can I do? Hmm. May I make a suggestion, Your Majesty? Please do, Tortoise. What a very good idea. Wanyama! Animals! Yes, 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 yes. We have a bird crisis in Tinga Tinga. And here is what I propose. Mm -hmm. I challenge any animal, bird or beast, to find hen's eggs, hummingbird's hum, and to find little tick bird. And the first animal to find all three will be given Half He's of my rude. kingdom. We Lion, you cannot be serious. Oh, but I am. Half my kingdom. Do you hear? Oh, oh, my yes. so let the challenge begin. Night animals, huh? Let's get a head start and start searching. Let's search. Quick, quick. Right, come on, off we go. <laughs> Where can hen's eggs be? And that poor little tick bird. Hmm. I can't see them anywhere. Aha! Uh -huh. Honey, maybe I will be able to find hummingbirds hum. Queen Bee, Jumbo Eagle. Ooh, what brings you here? It's very late. I'm so very sorry to disturb you in the middle of the night, but poor Hummingbird has lost her harm. But I don't know where it is, sweetie. I know, but I was wondering if you and your bees would be kind enough to give her a drop of your sweet honey. It may bring back her beautiful hum. What a clever idea. But I'm afraid all the bees are fast asleep now. Tomorrow will be just fine. We'd be delighted. 
Oh, and Queen, don't tell the other animals that I asked. Of course, dear. Now for Tickbird and Hen's eggs. Where can they be? Where can they be? Hmm. Of course, Crocodile. That naughty beast. There he is, fast asleep. And hen's eggs. I thought so. <laughs> hey, those are my eggs. Huh? No, they're not. They're hens. Finders keepers. Losers weepers. <laughs> Nothing in the trees. Nothing in the plains, Your Majesty. Nothing underground. Elephant? No. Tortoise? Mm -mm. Nothing, I'm afraid. Huh? It was Crocodile, Your Majesty. Oh. Crocodile stole hen's eggs. He was near Mount Tinga Tinga, hiding behind a rock. Oh, thank you, Eagle. Asante. Always a pleasure to help another bird. No news of tick bird? Nothing in the trees. Nothing on the ground? We looked all over Tinga Tinga. <gasps> But what about the scars? I haven't checked the scars. <laughs> Tickbird must be lost in the clouds. Now, where is she? I can't see her. Where's Eagle gone? Into the clouds, elephant. Mm. Remarkable bird. Tickbird! Tickbird! Mm. Now, where is she? <gasps> Tickbird! Oh! Tickbird! Uh, Eagle, thank goodness you're here. I've been lost in this cloud for ages. Don't worry, Tickbird. I'm here to get you. Oh! oh <laughs> Welcome home, Tickbird. Thank you, Hippo. Eagle, most impressive. Now, who can find and return hummingbird's hum? I'd be ever so grateful. Um. Your Majesty, may we give hummingbird some of our sweet honey? It might help hummingbird find her hum. By all means, Queen. Very good for the voice, sweetie. So sweet and smooth. Oh, but can you hum? Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> <laughs> These fun hummingbirds hum. <laughs> That's brilliant. Your Majesty, I knew it was our honey, but it was Eagle's idea. Really? Yes, but she didn't want anyone to know. Thank you, Queen. Asante. Wanyama, animals, I said I would give half my kingdom to the animal who succeeded in finding three things. Hen's eggs, little tick bird, and hummingbird's hum. I am delighted to tell you we have a winner! Ooh. Monkeys, drum roll please. <laughs> Here we go. And the winner is Eagle. <laughs> Couldn't possibly accept. Your eagle eyes found Mama Hen's eggs. Your great wings found Tickbird up in the clouds. And your mm. great kindness and wisdom found Hummingbird's hum. Mm. The sign of a true leader. Oh, my. From this day on, Eagle, you shall be ruler of the skies. With honor, Your Majesty. With honor. <laughs> is why eagle rules the skies. From that day on, lion ruled over the land animals and eagle watched over the birds. <laughs> what a wonderful and happy day. <laughs> Time for the night lullaby, your majesty. Indeed, indeed. Birds. <laughs> and now hummingbird. <laughs> and hummingbird humming. Well, that's a whole other story. 
Why Volta is bold. <laughs> but Volta wasn't always bold. Oh no. Here I come. Your gorgeous ray of sunshine. Your gorgeous ray of sunshine. <laughs> 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 Very funny, monkey. I know you are just jealous of my plumage. Plumage? What's plumage? The feathers on the top of my head. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you see, there was a time when Volta's plumage was made of the most beautiful feathers in Tinga Tinga. And did she know it? Look how my plumage sparkles, shining down on all you hairy beasts. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh no! Are my feathers all right? Tell me, am I still dazzling? Ah, can you believe that Vulture thought she was dazzling? We always thought she was quite plain. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> Jumbo, it's me. Vulture! Uh, Vulture thought she was more beautiful than Flamingo. Golden feathers are so much better than pink. But pink is romantic. And gold is the sun. The sun, the sun. With you, it's always the sun. Ooh. Hippo, mm -hmm. don't you ever wish you had beautiful feathers like me? Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Well... I like the feathers, but I'm not so keen on the face. <laughs> Plumage is so much better than skin. Oh, hmm. Vulture even thought she was more beautiful than Peacock. <laughs> now that's Plumage. Not bad, Peacock, but not quite as dazzling as me. Really, oh. Vulture? <laughs> Such a waste of my time. <sighs> oh. Oh. Adva, are my feathers all right? I don't know. Termites. That's what I want. Termites. Uh -uh. <laughs> More attention required. Your Highness, I know we birds should stick together, but uh, Vulture is truly an embarrassment. She needs someone or something to put her into her proper place. Hmm. My friends. How kind of you to gather and admire my beautiful plumage. <laughs> Vulture will go too far and she'll learn her lesson. You'll see. Look! I am magnificent. Quite ridiculous. Mm -hmm. oh. Mm -hmm. oh! What's happened? <laughs> The sun has gone in and stolen all the shine from your golden plumage. <laughs> <laughs> the sun! The sun! I must shine brighter than the sun! Vulture, careful! <laughs> the sun! The sun! Be careful, Vulture! It's hot, hot here. I must shine brighter than the sun! Her feathers will fry. You were right, Tortoise. This time, Vulture really is going too far. Surely not. She's vain, but she's not that stupid. The sun! The sun! I must shine brighter than the sun! Vulture, oh, no. oh, Don't hot. do it! What's that smell? Is something burning? Yo, Vulture, fire! Careful. You're on fire! Vulture. Fire! Fire? What are they squawking about? My dazzling crown of beautiful feathers. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, I rather like my new black tips. Makes my feathers even more beautiful. But you're still smoking. Yes, I am a little hot. Honey will make your feathers feel better. Honey, what a wonderful idea! It will make my feathers shine even more! <laughs> hey! 
don't forget to ask the bees. They get very angry if you don't. Oh, what's the point? Silly, silly bees. Stop the singing and the sagging about. Show me the honey. Any bees at home? No? <laughs> That's good. That's good. That feels really good. <laughs> and I bet I look good too. <laughs> Honeyed oh, and golden. Huh? Even more beautiful than the sun. Eh, eh, eh? Toto is my friend. That vulture hasn't learned her lesson at all. Bees! I tried to warn Vulture, but she wouldn't listen. <laughs> Those bees are angry. Golden and all honey. It was Vulture. <laughs> it was Vulture who stole a hand. Uh oh, fly, Vulture, fly! <laughs> Tortoise, you did try to tell her. Yep, some birds never listen. Ow! 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 <laughs> Wait for me! Wait for me! I come in! I come in! It's lovely and cool. That's better. How do I look? Beautiful, eh? 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 Kinda. <laughs> what? What? What is it? Um, you've just lost a few feathers. That's all. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Your head is as shiny and bald as my bottom. <laughs> No! <laughs> I've got no crown, I've got no plumage, I've lost my feathers. <laughs> uh, ah! Huh? Ah! My bloom! My beautiful, beautiful bloom! It's gone! I'm totally bald! Ah! <laughs> I'm bald! I'm bald! And that's why Vulture has a bald head. Don't look, uh, don't look at me. And from that day on, Vulture flew high up in the skies, so no one could see a bald head ever again. All my beauty has gone. I'm bald. I'm really, really bald. <laughs> Ooh, whoops. <laughs> don't look at me. I'm bald. And Advak in his underground hole? Well, that's a whole other story. <laughs> Bring me home.
Chesa, chesa, come on, dance. Imba, imba, come on, sing. Shuka, shuka, shake it down. Ruka, ruka, jump around. <laughs> 